In addition to the normal perform and tweak modes in Crystalline, there's now an extra settings screen. We can access that by tapping settings in the top left corner. And this may look a little overwhelming at first, but we're gonna go over all these different sections here. So we have controls for input gain, to adjust your input volume, same as for uh, output volume. The input button, when you tap that, you have the option to select between stereo or mono one or two for your inputs. It also says what sample rate you're running at. And output allows you to select various output styles to adjust the sound of the actual effect of Crystalline. On the left we have buffer size, which when Crystalline is running standalone, you can use this to select higher or lower latency. On the right we have background audio to turn background audio processing on or off when running standalone. In the center here we have MIDI channel, so you can enter what MIDI channel you want to receive on. And then the middle MIDI input toggle to receive uh, MIDI input. In iOS 8 and higher you can select Bluetooth MIDI setup and then turn on the advertise MIDI service switch. And this allows uh, Crystalline to be seen as a MIDI destination for um, sending MIDI over Bluetooth. You can also clear any mapped uh, MIDI settings, MIDI CCs that you assigned using MIDI Learn with a clear MIDI Learn settings button. The rest of the settings below will be covered in the next sections, so check those videos.